Hi kids, welcome to I Love Cat Machines. Would you like to operate a big cat machine someday? I might be very young, but I have some big ideas. I hope to drive a cat machine for many years I like the way they work as they pick up all that earth but the biggest thrill is a caterpillar I like the way it creeps what's that? the biggest thrill is a caterpillar I like the way it creeps Some move very slow, while others move real quick. They crush their way through stone and rock, and plow their way through brick. Their tracks, they make a nook as they pass. Hey, hey, take a look. But the biggest thrill is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps. What did you say? The biggest thrill is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps. Machines are big earth-moving machines made by the Caterpillar Company in factories like this all over the world. You might be wondering how the Caterpillar Company was named. It happened like this. A long time ago, someone watching a cat machine crawl slowly along said it reminded him of a caterpillar. The name stuck. <laughs> Caterpillar machines help build the world by digging, pushing, rolling, leveling, dumping, loading, planting, even flying. Okay, okay. Cat machines can't fly, but they sure have funny names. There are skitters and graders and excavators. asphalt pavers, and road reclaimers, soil stabilizers, and compactors, trucks, dozers, and tractors,
wheel loaders and backhoes. Even a roller coaster. I know, I know. Caterpillar doesn't make a roller coaster. I was just checking to see if you were listening. I hope you are because we may have a test later on. It takes a lot of work by a lot of people to build a cat machine. First, designers and engineers use computers and virtual reality to plot out every part that will go into the making of a cat machine. They want to make sure every part will fit and work perfectly. In the world of virtual reality, the image on the computer screen is three-dimensional. To enter the world of virtual reality, you need to wear a helmet like this. When you wear the helmet, this is what you see. Furnaces melt solid steel and other metals into a thick, hot liquid called iron. The hot iron is then poured into molds. The process is just like pouring hot jello into a jello mold, then taking the jello out after it hardens. Instead of jello, Caterpillar uses hot iron. When the metal hardens, it becomes a part that will be used in putting together a big cat machine. Each worker does a different job. Some build the engines. Some bolt or weld the parts together. Others work on the details. But before any machine leaves the factory, it is painted caterpillar yellow and receives the caterpillar logo. This is a part for a cat machine so big it has to be shipped by truck in pieces and assembled on the site. Cat machines are also loaded on flat cars. Cat machines loaded on flat cars. They do that every day. That choo-choo train takes those cat machines to places far away. When you see that train coming down that track and you hear the sound of that clickety-clack, you know those cat machines riding on flat cars going places far away. Now those cat machines, they love to ride choo-choos. Riding rail is a thrill. See them come. Hey, see them go. Hey, there's one coming over the hill. See that train chugging down the track. Listen to the sound of that clickety-clack. Oh, those cat machines loaded on flat cars. They do that every day. Yeah. 
Caterpillar is a thrill of the way it creeps. Now cut machines working in the mines, driving hard all day. A pushing rock and pushing off. Listen to the motors roar. Wheel loaders, wheel loaders, scooping up all. Always seem to be asking for more. Yellow trucks of the caterpillar really are a big time thriller. A big cat trucks are tough and strong, carrying loads all day long. Caterpillar is a thriller. Caterpillar is a thriller. Caterpillar is a thriller. Caterpillar is a thriller. Up and down the mountain with a beautiful sky above. Cat machines doing their thing, doing the job they love. Caterpillar is a thrill I love the way it creeps. This is a Beale Mountain Mine located in the Rocky Mountains in southwestern Montana. This Cat 990 wheel loader is loading gold ore into a 55-ton Cat Off-Road haul truck. The truck takes the ore to the top of a ridge and dumps it. Cat dozers push the ore down to the crusher where the ore is broken into little pieces. It takes 20 tons of ore to make one ounce of gold. Each truck carries about 50 tons, so that means there are about two and a half ounces of gold in every truckload. Jewelry and money are the most common uses for gold. But gold is also used in computers, telephones, camcorders, airplanes, hospitals, even on spacecraft. Miners use dynamite to break up the ore. This machine drills holes into the rock where the sticks of dynamite are placed. Then the boss blows the warning siren, and everyone hurries from the blast site. Clear the area! Everyone out! Take cover! Five, four, three, I said call in the cat compactor mm. when the road is kind of bumpy. Mm. I just one pass, you will find the way will no longer be bumpy. And the biggest thriller is a caterpillar. I love the way it creeps. Wow, I said the biggest thriller is a caterpillar. Mm. I love the way it creeps. Wow. You see these cat machines wherever there's loose dirt to be packed tight or a road to be made smooth. The round knobs on the roller are called feet. They press into the ground and pack it tight. 
Cat smooth wheel rollers are used to flatten bumps and make the road smooth. Glacier National Park is located in Montana's northern Rockies. We are driving on the Going to the Sun Road, the main highway through Glacier Park. Driving this road almost takes your breath away. You see roaring waterfalls, fast flowing streams, beautiful sunsets, clear glacier lakes, a gorgeous sky. wildflowers, and spectacular vistas around every curve. They call this a weeping wall. You could drive so close to the wall that the icy cold water splashes on your car. These handsome tourist buses are called jammers. They were made for Glacier Park in 1937 by the White Motor Car Company in Cleveland, Ohio. Riding in a jammer is a fine way to see all the sights on the going to the sun road, even when it rains. About 100 years ago, cat machines were powered by steam. They were kind of strange looking and made a lot of noise. but they were powerful and very handy to have around. <laughs> but even though cat machines were useful, people still thought they looked funny. Hollywood even made a movie about caterpillar machines.
no! Train's coming! circus you'll love circus world it's located in baraboo wisconsin and there's a big show and circus parade every day circus world also has the world's greatest collection of antique circus parade wagons circuses used to travel by train and these colorful wagons were used to take the performers, equipment, and animals from the train to the place where they would set up the circus. The idea was to attract attention and make everyone want to go to the circus. The idea worked. The folks at Circus World fixed up these magnificent old wagons and made them glitter like new. Today, everyone is getting ready for the big circus parade in Milwaukee. The stars of the parade are Circus World's antique circus wagons. The wagons are being loaded on flat cars for the trip. Old D4 and D6 cat dozers work with teams of horses to load the wagons. This is John Lloyd. John loves the circus and also loves to drive his cat D4 dozer. Emily, look at John. He sure loves to drive that old cat dozer and show off in front of us. Oh, he's just having fun, George. But I hope they let him load the circus wagons so we can get some sleep. John's D4 was made 50 years ago, but it's still in fine shape and still can do a full day's work. John is a happy man today. They're letting him use his D4 to help load the circus wagons. Emily and George are happy too. <coughs> First, the wagons are hooked to the dozers and driven over to the loading area. There, the first team of horses pulls the wagons up the ramp and onto the flat car. Another team pulls the wagons across the flat cars. Then John and his trusty cat dozer take over and pull the wagon the last few feet. 
Big wood blocks are placed in front and in back of the wagon wheels so the wagons won't roll off the flat car. After all the wagons are loaded, a diesel engine is coupled to the lead flat car and off they go. It's almost the end of the day, and the circus train is covered by the soft light of a summer Wisconsin sunset. Isn't that a lovely sight? Hey, watch me. Look here. Ladies and gentlemen, may we have your attention, please? The circus train show attraction is about to begin. Right over here is where you're about to see the train. Okay, time for our test. When the video stops, you name the cat machine. Wheel loader. Very good. Baker, Baker, this is the cat Heavy Iron Express just arriving at the Popsicle factory. I'd like to order two Popsicles, one orange and one cherry. Over. I copy Cat Heavy Iron Express. This is the Popsicle factory. Can do on the orange and cherry Popsicles. You can pick them up at Porky's Diner right next to our factory. Over. Mr. Popsicle, and thank everyone at Porky's, too. See you guys next time through. Over and out. These big cat machines are fun to watch, but they can also be very dangerous. Never play around or try to climb up on any kind of big machine. Time to go. Hope you enjoyed the show. Remember, eat your vegetables and be nice to old people. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hooray, hooray, hooray. Step right up for the greatest display of powerful cat machines the world has ever seen. Welcome to Cat Machines on Parade!
I might be very young, but I have some big ideas. I hope to drive that machine, not for many years. I like the way they work as they pick up all of that earth. But the biggest drug is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps. What's that? The biggest drug is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps. <laughs> Some move very slow while others move real quick. They crush their way through stone and rock and plow their way through brick. Their tracks, they make a nook as they pass. Hey, hey, take a look. But the biggest thriller is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps. What did you say? The biggest thriller is a caterpillar. I like the way it creeps.